Good morning, everybody. Happy Wednesday. All right. Um, here I am live on Instagram. This is still a little bit a little bit new to me. I haven't done a lot of lives, but I am trying to get more used to it. So um, for anybody that ends up seeing this, I hope you're having a wonderful day. I'm out in Southern California, so it's still kind of, it's 8.30 in the morning here. So I wanted to hop on. I've got a really busy day ahead of me, but there's something uh, I really kind of exciting that I wanted to share. So for those of you that don't know me, I am with a hair company, a hair product company called Monate. And I've been with the company over four years, and um, I have seen my hair change drastically as, as well as all my customers and my market partners, my team, my downlines hair. So, um, but we have a new development in our product line, but I'm gonna kind of start with, um, with this ingredient um, outside of our hair products. So I'm gonna talk today about hyaluronic acid. I know that's really hard to say. Uh, some of you may or may not be familiar with it. So what kind of started my mind, my wheels turning here, was yesterday I went shopping at Bath & Body Works and um, I came across this cream, this body cream. I was actually just looking for Christmas gifts and um, but I came across this uh, hydrating body cream and look what it has in it. It has hyaluronic acid in it. So this is from Bath & Body Works. I used it this morning for the first time. I absolutely love it. Um, and it got me thinking that I wanted to share with everybody that I've learned just in the last two or three months that hyaluronic acid is a big buzzword in the beauty product industry, especially skincare products. And I wanna kind of just um, talk a little bit about that and what hyaluronic acid is and why it's so valuable. And this is really interesting too. I actually use a face moisturizer from Ulta. It looks like this. And it's a gel cream moisturizer and it also has hyaluronic acid in it. Now I've been using this for a year and didn't even really understand what that was until just recently because the hair product company I'm with figured out a way to put it in hair products. But let's first talk about why this is so valuable in your, first of all, your skincare, um, because you might wanna go out and find some things with this in it and see if you like it. So first of all, uh, hyaluronic acid, it's kinda called the hero skincare ingredient. And let me tell you why, I have a couple fun facts for you. So first of all, what is it? Our skin cells are made up um, almost entirely of water and our own skin cells produce hyaluronic acid naturally. So this isn't something you're putting into your body and on your skin that's foreign to your body. Our body produces it. But um, as we age or if we're in a very dry climate or you know we're exposed to not enough moisture in the air, because our skin and our hair tries to pull moisture from the air and if there isn't any, it can't. So then it starts drying out and the hyaluronic acid in our body decreases. So um, if you can find products with that in it, you can replenish that. So um, what is it? Hyaluronic acid is a water-loving molecule. It, can, it attracts and retains up to a thousand times its weight in water. I mean, this is a very powerful little molecule. It makes your skin more smooth and supple, and it actually locks in that water for up to 72 hours. So it's a very powerful ingredient in your products, and this is why I had no idea why I even liked this face moisturizer. I just knew I liked it. I had no idea why and why that was so powerful. So, um, uh, hyaluronic acid also has antioxidant properties. So this is a really um, powerful little molecule and ingredient. So check your um, skincare products especially. So once more, Bath & Body Works has this hyaluronic acid. It's called Hydrating Body Cream. They also have a cream gel, I saw. I decided to try this one first. Love it. I might try the other one too next time I go. And again, from Ulta, this gel cream moisturizer for your face. But here's what I'm super excited about. Because of the company that I'm with, our hair products, um, they have, I believe we're the first company to do this, if not one of the first, to figure out how to put this in a hair product and so it's beneficial for your hair too. So this is not a skincare product, this is a hair product. 
So we came out a couple months ago with um, an ultra hydration line. It's a collection. It's got a shampoo and a conditioner. Um, but the mask and the serum in our collection, these two items, have hyaluronic acid in them. And these have been a game changer for people with super dry hair. Now, let me just uh, back up. So um, water is different. Hi okay, so hi our hair needs hydration. It also needs moisturization. And wouldn't you think that's the same thing? I always thought it was too. Hydration is water. Moisture is oil-based. So our hair needs both. So both of these products actually have our Rejuvenique oil in it and also a new product called Patch H2O, which is uh, where our hyaluronic acid comes in. So um, I actually use our restructuring line, which is a little bit newer than this line or collection, but I always use these little serums for my treatments, okay? Because um, like every three or four days, I'll treat my hair the night before I'm gonna wash it, because I only have to wash about it once every four days because of our products. They've changed my hair so much that I don't have to wash entirely. Hi there, how you doing? Um, let me wave at you. <laughs> I'm still learning how to do uh, live on Instagram, so bear with me. But yeah, these little serums, um, all every fourth night, the night before I'm gonna wash my hair, I'll just douse it. It's these little vials. Let me take one out. It comes in a package of three. But the little vial looks like this. So you just kind of shake it up. It becomes this milky substance. So again, it's got the, um, it's got the, um, what do you call it? It's got the water and the um, S3, which is the oil. So it's a combination of both. And I'll just douse my hair in it. And one little vial lasts me two or three times. So it's not just one each time. So I'll douse it the night before and I'll sleep in it. And in the morning I'll wash, I'll do my wash and you know what I normally do with my products and what a difference it makes. Especially right now, um, we're entering the winter months. I'm in Southern California, so it's not been cold during the day at all, but at night it's been getting cold. So my heater even goes off. And you guys, that heater in your house can wreak havoc on your skin and your hair, it dries things out. So. Um, I love this. I love to sleep in it in the morning. My hair just feels amazing. So I really kind of wanted to share that. I thought it was really interesting about this hyaluronic acid. So uh, gosh, do some research. If you are having issues with very, very dry hair, uh, reach out to me and I'll kind of explain more about it and see if you'd like to try it. Um, if you have anything going on with your hair that you'd like to improve or uh, change, doesn't even have to be dryness, it can be unmanageability. Do you need some hair growth? Uh, is your hair too fine and thin? Uh, is it too coarse and crazy and curly? You wanna define that a little bit? Reach out to me, I'd love to talk to you about it and help you out, I'm just really, uh, I'm here to help people with their hair, that's what I do. I've been doing it for four years absolutely love it. So I hope you all have a tremendous day and um, let me know if you have any questions. DM me if you do, but hopefully uh, you find this as interesting as I do. Hopefully it wasn't too sciencey. I'm not a very sciencey person, but something like this just kind of spikes my interest and I want to know why it's working. So you all have a fabulous Wednesday and um, I hope to talk to you soon. Take care everybody. Bye-bye.